One of the things I love is a Swiss army knife. I remember as a kid seeing my dad carry these around all the time. Now he used to buy them by the dozen because TSA would take them away whenever he was traveling for business because he'd just forget them in his pockets. But I remember how fascinated I was with all the little functions that were kept tidy inside. Now let's fast forward a few months to me watching one of Maddie's videos where he was using this tripod that I'd never seen before called the Mantis Pod. I texted him after and said, Maddie, where did you get that tripod? Because it actually looks sick. So this video is sponsored by PGY Tech, but I wanna show you the nuances of what makes this little tripod my favorite new piece of kit for 2022. So far, the year's not over yet. That could change, probably will. Now, why am I telling you the story of my dad's Swiss army knife? Well, I feel like this draws some parallels. This tripod kind of feels like a Swiss army knife in and of itself with how many functions and different things hidden inside it that it has. That's why I thought they kind of feel related. Also, listen to this. This is ridiculous. Woo. Kirk, how does that sound? Just like farting in a toilet. Don't. All right, tripod test number one. Can it just go on random stumps? Did, who cut this? That looks straight up just boop. Bam, get this. I'm not happy with the light in here. Ugh, people don't clean up after their dogs, which means thoughts in a forest will be postponed until summer when this is just not as gnarly. I heard you. Oh, you did? I was like, Gabriel's got to be here. <laughs> Thank you for the beautiful footage. You're welcome. I, I see that you're carrying this in your hand, not in, it's not in a bag. My bag's really heavy. Excuses, he just didn't bring a camera bag. <laughs> Again, it's just, heavy. just holding a drone, like just walking around holding a drone. I'm haunted by the jokes that you've made. All right, first things first, look at the footprint. That goes inside any camera bag. That's the ball head. Now you don't have to take this off, but that slides on real easy and tightens down. So that's the entire footprint. This ball right here moves the main hinge. Now, if you wanted to extend the reach, so you wanted to extend that vlogging arm, you can do that. And what you would do is you would take this ball head off just as we put it back on. There's a little button on the side, hit the button on the side and the big long button and it extends all the way out. This little tab here, that opens, reveals another hot shoe. Take that head, slide it in, lock it down, and now you've got an even longer arm for vlogging. I know. Do you remember the first video of this year I posted about my red 1977 Stepside F100 Walt? Well, at the end of that video, I said, we'll see you in the spring. It's spring. Remember this guy? everyone's favorite ginger. We are rare, you know. It's a mystery to me how it all could happen. A puzzle I just can't solve. Howard, you have a lot of stuff in the back here. Your bed is gonna be similar color. People have been requesting you. To do? Just more Howard. This, no, I don't believe you. Just, yo, we need more of Howard. It's about to get crazy. Not today. Today's serious today. Today's stain day. We're stain well, steady hands, steady mind. What the people want, they want, they want the ginger Howard. They want the wild man. <laughs> Fancy one off of that. Yeah, I like it. Can you trust it? Look, we're at this is on a this is on a bucket right now. Isn't that great? Yeah, I always forget about it. It's great, isn't it? This little hook right here. Look at this. This extends out and that hooks on to the back of something. And then these feet contact a surface and then this moves up. So you have hands-free vlogging literally anywhere. 
and it's just this little hook, this tiny little thing does that. Good to go. Tell them about the light meter. Your, your first job you wanted? Yeah. I don't remember the store, but I remember you telling me one day that there you were, you were proud, you were bold, you had a camera, you'd gone to a facility to get a job, and I remember you said that the guy asked you, oh, you do wonderful pictures, that's great, do you know how to use a light meter? And you were like, uh, what? You know, you do it on the fly. You see the scene, you see the sky, and, and you take the shot. And so, you didn't get the job. No. <laughs> but then you told him, screw you. I'll go do my own work. Yeah. That's what you did. I would love to go back to that store now oh. and pay for their services <laughs> with my own minted currency. <laughs> so this is just one one coat. What I'm doing is I'm putting it on and wiping it off. And I'm sure there's 3,721 people that'll say, I'm doing it wrong. It's so very wrong. But... I don't care. You're not here. And you don't get to hang out with Peter, Captain Kirk, too. Let's not leave Kirk out. He's good people. So, there's always a wrong way to do stuff. Then there's a right way. What's the final stain called? The coffee. <laughs> <laughs> so we got Brazilian rosewood. And then, it's a walnut, right? That's if it sounds as a walnut, we'll be intermediate. Then the final coat will be coffee, and that's upstairs. <laughs> Bye, Howard. <laughs> I think what got me was being able to flip the mic around so you could hear yourself better and then flip it to hear the subject without having to move the entire camera or reposition the mic on a hot shoe. That blew my mind. Inside one of the feet, press that button, it opens. Do you notice that? This is a hidden tripod mount for a smartphone that unfolds and extends depending on what size phone you have. And that little piece also, so you can vlog on your phone or you can set the phone up as a tripod. This is one of those items that ends up in everyone's my top five favorite pieces of equipment for 2022. It's a good solution. I'll leave the link in the description below if you wanna check out a Mantis pod of your very own. I think my favorite part will be not having to stick a big tripod in the side of my camera bag. And every time I get into my truck, when I swing my bag into the back seat, smoking the door well and crushing all the paint on the inside frame. I'll never learn because it's the inside of the door. I mean, who, who really cares? No one looks there, I don't think. Also, Got a new machine for the shop. It's called the Bell Skyver. I'm very excited. I also got some of these old vintage t-shirts that I used to make when I had my leather business and I reprinted a bunch with my friend. He screen printed them all uh, and I put my old company logo back on it. I just thought that was cool, Montgomery Leather Works. So I might, maybe I'll give some of these away. That might be cool. I got XL, large, and medium. Hmm.